storage it's always an issue when it comes to figures accessories stuff like that so um i where i forget where i was maybe home depot had a bunch of these getting clearanced out so some people like myself keep their figures in jewelry boxes or maybe like a tackle box kind of thing like this these are now my one six scale accessories i had a lot of mezco stuff in here but since i no longer have mezco stuff i put um my sideshow and hot toys accessories in here when i can it makes it a little bit easier to access them rather than having to go dig into a box or if you have a box in storage if you can fit them in here why not so i get the little uh polyurethane bags i have a bunch of different sizes if you go to like your you can order them online, but for like the smaller ones like this or for the ones that were like uh, one and a half by two or one and a half by one and three quarters, you can get all different sizes at the hobby stores. So if you go to, um, if you go to like AC more, if that's even a thing anymore, Hobby Lobby, you can get bags. So I got Superman hands, um, TB League hands in here, all my Joker accessories on that one and then th these boxes are nice because these ones have slots you can remove the slots so you can make it bigger or smaller any size you want depending on the accessories that go in, go in there again i forget where these were but they were like a dollar or two bucks so i ended up buying a bunch um this one here is nice because this is a bigger one so for things like you don't want to get beat up if you want to put your hands in their own bag i put my wolverine head wrapped in plastic just to avoid scuff marks um i can slide these sections here in and out to make them bigger like here's one of those smaller bags i used to keep all my mezco stuff in there but um this is great for organization purposes it's like look i got hot toys luke skywalker all this stuff in there hot toys uh punisher war machine i keep his stuff in there the the uh, nice thing is that once it's closed up, everything's pretty much secure and legit in its spot. And there's no space up top for anything to really slide around. And then in here, more Hot Toy stuff. Spider Punk hands. Scarlet Spider accessories. Webs. All the stuff that came with the Scarlet Spider extra eyes. Spider-Man hands. So... If you get enough of these, and then, like, again, this is cool. I can slot it how I like. Make it a small section. So it can be that wide. It can be this wide. It can be an entire row. Swords, long stuff, anything you want. You know, pens. This is good. I guess even for paints, if you have paint brushes or something you want to keep in there. But, you know, this is just a good way to store accessories. Because a lot of people will be like, how do you store your accessories? So this was great, especially with Mezco's, because like you saw with the little bag, for my Mezco, I could just put, like, you know, an extra head in each bag, and then all the hands would fit in one. Um, Punisher guns, I could put separate guns in here. And then storing your accessories in containers like this really help. Marvel Legends extra hands if you're customizing it helps. There are drawers you can do with like the stack drawers and you can slide out. I scored a bunch of those at um Target. They were cheap. I think they were like less than five dollars each. But I keep paint and paint brushes in these and plastic bags and stuff. You can also keep figures and stuff in that. But I like that you can have the smaller compartments so maybe one figure with some hands could go in here, you know, or big things. And you can just make it, you can customize it, make it as big as you need or as small as you need. All right, so that's that for that. These are some of my favorite, favorite things to store figures in. I have these three and I don't think I have any more at the moment of these, but I love these, they're clear. They're small, but big enough. I think this is maybe like an inch and a half tall. So not too big, but just big enough for what you need. You can fit a, even a one six scale head in there. All right, but that's what I use to store figures. 
All right, later.